We will find out. So I've been talking to myself for the last five minutes. That's, that's cool. Hello, everybody. To the 13th Chompathon. Oh, I can hear myself. Right, it is working now. 13th Chompathon. And uh, it's actually a year since the first Chompathon. Which is nice. I'm going to just switch my own voice off because it's annoying. Let me get rid of that one. Oh, I'm dead. Alright. Now we can, we'll, we'll try again. Alright. Hello, everybody. Again. Here is the 3.4 update preview, which you have been waiting for. As a lot of you have guessed, yes, it is to do with the sky. Or more specifically, exploring the sky. So we have for you, you can get yourself a jetpack by completing 50 missions. Uh, or you can use a shark launcher just to throw yourself into the air and you don't have to boost. But I suggest you get the jetpack because it's way more fun. Everything that you collect in the sky is worth way more points. So if you are a high school hunter, Prepare yourself for some from mad high scores. We can collect these constellations that are randomly generated. Some of them are quite fun, little things. Oh! There is this guy who's pushing. who is killing me. Fine. So there is enemy great whites with jetpacks, which you can chomp on. Yes, revenge. We have biplanes that are taking a shot at you. Have a little dogfight in the sky. It to be one of the larger sharks to take him out. There we go. And there he goes, shatters into pieces. You can take the... Oh, more helicopters, more biplanes. Gems. Whoa, so much. Right, you can have the... Not a hot air balloon, what is it? A weather balloon. Which will give you boost so that you can keep flying forever and getting gold rush is super easy because you can chain all of these stars together bye bye uh, and then you get killed by the jetpack guy again flipping use all my gems and shall I come here there we go and he's just been cut loose so let's kill him so we have this um, astro baby as well which decreases the rate in which you fall you can dive into the ocean go back to be classic shark mode oops now there's one more thing in the sky. I oh, know there's two more things actually that we haven't seen yet. We've seen the biplane, we've seen the jetpack dude. Seems like my colleague has decided to start breaking other people's stuff. Ah, we're gonna die. We need to find something to eat. Oh, ah, dead. Who runs? What's it say? That was cool. So, seeing as a jetpack, um, well, if you don't have the jetpack, you know who you can also take. You can take Robo Shark because he's got a built-in jetpack, and he is the master of the skies. Let's take him out for a whirl. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Woo! 
And he just looks so beautiful. Woo! He is in his element. Ooh, that's a bad sound that it's making though. Robo-shark, you found your home and the stars. And you're unresponsive. Now the funny thing about Robo-shark is... Yes, as I said, his home is in the stars, apparently. But, if we can find him, there is an enemy Robo-shark as well. Whoa, that's a funny noise. We need food. Ah, uh, we are dead. Well, that's the joy of gems. <laughs> Woo! Now, there is an enemy robo shark that will spawn if I can actually achieve a high score, which I apparently can't. Let's just eat these guys. There we go. There we go, level two. It's a bit better. With the tall shark launcher up into the skies. There's a biplane. Don't really want to go toe to toe with him. Ah, he shot us. Who'd have thought a bullet would damage a piece of metal? Future Games of London. That's who. So if you guys have any questions, it doesn't have to be about this update. Well, I'd prefer it to be, because that's what we're doing. But if you have any questions about Hungry Shark or anything like that, let us know, and I shall endeavour to answer. If my moderator tells me what you guys are saying at any point, would be fabulous. Lily, lily, lily. We need to get some food because we are going to die. We are going to die unless we eat something. Mm. Delicious sailfish. I love the way they taste. Into the mouth of the robot. Woohoo! And there's the moon. And we actually did go over the moon. Ha oh, ha! Oh, the pun worked perfectly. Come here, you. Yes. And you. Yes. I wish I could fly into the sky so very high. And I can. Ow. Turn around, Robini. We are gonna die unless we die. Eat the things. Eat all of the things and then you can fly into the sky. No, I don't want to be launched. Oh no! Mega Munch! An adult Astro Shark? Hmm, what would that be? Would that be a cool shark or a special shark? Oh, boo! Yeehaw! And uh, Godzilla asks, will any new oh, Is it Godzilla Ewan? It is indeed. Hello, Godzilla Ewan. Nice to see you again. It says, uh, will you make any more special shows? We might. Uh, what do you suggest? And don't suggest Godzilla again, because that's not a shark. Ah, uh, Schneeschnar is my favourite. We take Schneeschnar out in his gentleman clothes from last time. Schneeschnar, happy. Ah! <laughs> oh my gosh, and with the firework as well, this is madness. <laughs> and I've got the vortex. Suck em up, suck em up, make it shine. <laughs> Ah, oh, Schneeshna. Oh, hello. Top chum. What, what? And this level extension is in the update. It costs nothing. It is just there. Ah, oh my god, the enemy robo. Ah! Comrade Hello. Says, uh, can you use the big daddy next time? 
Can I use the Big Daddy? I most certainly can. Let me know what accessories you want us to don. And we'll take him out for a ride. Ooh, Goldfish. Uh, your, your main man, Godzilla, mm. suggests an adult lava shark. Adult lava shark is a popular suggestion. Uh, I think he would be a, a, a special shark, probably. But how does one breathe fire underwater, is my question. Magic fire. Magic fire. Makes sense. Because we have so much magic in this game already. Let's just throw some fire in there. That's underwater. Like in Spongebob. My colleagues are wondering if I'm speaking to myself. I am not. <laughs> Contrary to regular behaviour. Ah! Ah! Oh, I missed. I mean, flip's sake, of course. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, I keep missing. It would be so epic. Oh, fine. The shark. When will this update be ready? Um, this update will be released this Thursday. So Thursday, the twenty seventh of August. You have a look on Facebook, Twitter, or your usual channels. You will see us advertising that it is ready for your enjoyment. Ah, ah. And how many hours Me personally? Oh, I don't know. Quite a lot, I would say. More than, more than your average hungry sharker. So I've worked here for nearly two years. Oh, poo! All right, Big Daddy. Did anyone have any uh, accessory suggestions? Yay, nay, just Big Daddy. Just a smooth Big Daddy, clean, smooth and clean like a beluga whale. A top hat? Alright then, we'll wear a top hat. We have an in-house suggestion of a top hat. Oh, oh, and a skateboard! Whoa! Now that's really making a, making some waves. See you later, John. Alright, top hat. Where is it? There it is. What else do we want? Blazer. Blazer isn't a thing. Head laser. Oh, laser. Right. <laughs> I, can't, I can't have the laser and the top hat. And eye patch is already on. Got a stash on and also a F gold necklace because I always wear that because uh, representing. Uh, I'm going to switch blood bath off. Oh, we're going to take something else along with the ride. Should we have the firework on? Firework. Uh, little daddy. Little daddy. All right, where is he? Where is that ugly? There he is. Oh, he is too expensive for me. Uh, can I? Yeah. Everybody's excited for Thursday when we release the update. Woo! Everybody in the world. And don't forget that this was all inspired by Discovery Channel's Shark Weekend program, Air Jaws. You know, the one with the great white sharks all boosting out of the water, eating the seals, eating the seal decoys, eating. It's kind of a theme for sharks. We've picked up on it a little bit with this game. I'm hearing things I shouldn't be hearing. <laughs> yeah, Big Daddy. He's the boy! So I put the skateboard on to do a level where you're predominantly in the air. Woo! Ah! 
Shweekend. Yes, so Shweekend starts this weekend on the 29th of August. Um, and there's lots of great programming. It's just a, sort of an end to a great shark week we've had this year, sort of a summer of shark. And it's going to be magical. It's going to be such a joy to finish up the programming with Air Jaws and uh, Mythbusters as well, always one of my favourites. But it's not the end, there will be more updates for Hunger Shark after this. So that's why I ask you, keep giving us your suggestions. And we will think about putting them in the game.